Nintendo have finally released some information about their mysterious new console, the Nintendo NX. So what the hell is it, really? I'm Alana, welcome to Button Bash. According to a report in the Wall Street Journal, the exact shape of the NX hardware isn't yet clear. People familiar with the development plans said Nintendo likely will introduce both a console and at least one mobile unit that could either be used in conjunction with the console or taken on the road for separate use. They also said Nintendo would aim to put industry-leading chips in the NX devices after criticism that the Wii U's capabilities didn't match those of its competitors. Now to me this sounds something like an expansion on the Wii U with the console and the gamepad, except that maybe the gamepad in the NX equation will function as a handheld console independently of the Wii U in the equation. It's unclear if the NX will be offered as two separate units that happen to be paired together for sales purposes or sold separately, but just compatible if you have both, but it does seem like the platform intends to merge Nintendo's console and handheld gaming strategies. The journal's report also states that Nintendo has started distributing a software development kit for the NX, which could indicate a 2016 release date. Analyst David Gibson told the outlet that it looks likely it'll launch next year because of the softness of the 3DS and Wii U as well, but Nintendo themselves have declined to comment. A Kotaku source said that the release is scheduled for late October, though we're unsure how reliable that source is, and Square Enix have already announced that the upcoming Dragon Quest XI will be coming to the Nintendo NX, but Nintendo have only said we're going to have to wait to hear more about it. Beyond that, there's mostly just been a lot of speculation. Forbes mentioned that it will be more powerful than the Xbox One and PlayStation 4 with industry-leading chips. Tech Radar reported on a tablet S patent issued by Nintendo, which indicates the console may actually be a home and handheld console rolled into one, and an image leaked from another patent shows a smaller version of the gamepad being used as a handheld. But unfortunately, that's all the news we have so far. We might just have to wait until next year to hear more, just like Nintendo wants. I'm Alana, thanks for watching Button Bash. Mm -hmm.